the bluff mountaintop house donnie drove up and uh mark drove up on the way here and then the next couple days lisa was the driver the cleaning lady did say that there was a mama bear and two cubs that do come around here so it's got the circle driveway and there's the house and there's the uh upstairs mark calls it a turret they do have the bear garbage cans The dogs are barking because they're in the car about to go home and they don't like being in the car without Mark and Lisa. You don't want to get too close to here because that is like a really steep straight line rock drop it's got beautiful views if you're not afraid to come up a scary road somebody has to be able to drive up the scary road to get up here but for like even once in a lifetime to see this view, uh, if you can get somebody to drive up, <laughs> it's worth it. Here's the uh, morning view from the lower deck. Hot tub, picnic table, this is the grill. They do have a uh, doggy gate attached here to keep a small child or a dog inside the deck. We have a hot tub here and uh, it got warm and it was nice to sit in the grill. Uh, they have internet and um, direct TV but I'm, I'm going to tell you the internet the internet was not good here. My It kept my stuff kept circling and circling and circling when I was trying to um, do something. So um, don't depend on the internet if you need to depend on the internet because it, it was not good at all. But otherwise, everything here was great. The sign says Ruby's Cliffside. And uh, they do have uh, bare garbage cans down there. The uh, cleaning lady said there is a mama bear and two cubs that come around here. They do have a couple of four by fours at the bottom to try to prevent a kid or a dog from pushing it out. They have internet and they have um, direct TV. And then uh, this is the side deck going down. The side is actually attached with a zip tie. It's attached on one side with a um, little screw thing. This is the view from my bed in the morning. It's got absolutely beautiful views. This is the highest elevation um, view that I have seen in this area. Yesterday, I was, 
I'm not sure if I was on this deck or probably. And uh, I saw a helicopter flying and it was down below us. We were higher than the helicopter. You can hear the dogs in this direction. down there. It sounds like a gravel road. But you can hear the cars driving on it. You can hear the car on that road below. You can hear the birds too. Now, the drive up would have really scared me so much if I was driving. But um, Donnie said he thought it was fun. So, <laughs> he likes roller coasters. I don't. See what I mean? It almost looks like there's snow over there on the mountain, but it's probably frost. Got up to uh, catch the sunrise.
and you can see the sunset through the windows at the cabin. This is probably the highest that I have been yet <laughs> in, in uh, this area of the Smoky Mountains. Ruby's Cliffside. You can see the city lights at night. That's the view. The views, according to the map, are from Seymour to Sevierville. The views are just absolutely beautiful from up here. Sunrises and sunsets and night sky. That heater makes a lot of noise. This is the room up here. It's got some nice views up here. It's another staircase that goes what? up there. What? I'm not sure what that staircase goes to. An attic. Attic. So this is the room right here. You get down here yet? Nope. First time up here. It's got another game thing here. This is the view from the third floor uh, turret window. Up here, huh? Mm -hmm. Oh, the sun's starting to hit that mountain. Way. 
Donde and Joyful elves are here with us and they picked out their snacks. Of course, Hubby Donnie brought the uh, oranges and the um, bananas, but the homeowners for this rental home provide the snacks. It says, welcome to our home, please enjoy the snacks. That is something I haven't seen in any other rentals that we've rented, so that's really sweet touch. This is absolutely rare. They have a sauna here at this house. It's got the instructions out here. I guess it plays um, CDs. And then in the sauna, oh look! There's uh, Donne and Joyful having a sauna. They also have uh, more of the instruct thing in here. So that's what it's like with the light on. You can actually see through the uh, window. And there's Donne and Joyful elves having a sauna. Next to the sauna, they do have uh, a heater here and um, if it gets cold you do want to have it sitting here pointing at you. This is the downstairs living room. There's just one sofa here. They do have this fireplace. The washer and dryer is here and then this is the um, the other bathroom. I'm telling you this is a nice feature. This handicap bar they have it um, next to the toilet upstairs and next to the toilet downstairs and um, this is a walk-in shower and a nice feature <laughs> is the seat to set down in the shower they do have um, some guest books to sign this is the oh, kitchen area uh, we did pack the dishes in the dishwasher, she, Lisa or Donnie did, and uh, dishwasher is full, so there's a lot more dishes down there right now. They have cups, uh, plates and dishes, uh, bowls and cups, microwave, a uh, coffee maker, a toaster, cutlery, and a little toaster oven. You have plastic uh, ware for um, your leftovers if you're eating here. And then they have like salt and pepper and seasonings. And uh, here's the plates. A large capacity refrigerator. It was clean and um, uh, ice maker. And they have the um, this other game area here. They have the one up in the top, but they have this one here also. And of course, I like the feature that's patriotic. <laughs> oh, this is a nice feature too. If you have someone that is um, has mobility issues, uh, they do have this electric seat that goes to the top. All right, one last view from the upper deck. We're checking out, but this is the upstairs. We slept in it, of course. It's family style up here. So this is the bed that Donnie and I slept in, and uh, my brother and Lisa slept over there. They really had the towels folded cutely, kind of like a bow and stuff, but these extra blankets were in these two top drawers here and uh, we did need them the first night um, for some reason we didn't have that heater on right it kept, it sh came on and shut off but the second night my brother got it on right and it, it stayed really warm we didn't even really need the blankets after that so there's a little um, upstairs living room here and then um, a television and then this um, main bed here, the bigger bed, um, it has its own little television right here. And then uh, the bathroom, which has a walk-in shower.
All the decorations in the house aren't bears and things like that. It's more unique style, and then it's got some um, real pretty paintings. Downstairs, there's a washer and dryer, and then uh, there's the sauna and the sofa downstairs. And then walking back over towards the kitchen, there's the little game thing and the stairs to go upstairs, and then going out on the lower deck. trying to move around so that it will actually come outside. Mark's closing the hot tub. And then it's trying to maneuver around the people but still follow me. It's pretty cool. My brother thought it was pretty cool. And then I'm trying to get it to land on my hand. Sometimes you have to really move your hand under it to get it to land.
section where I had it go zoom out and back in and um, I was showing what it was like there on the deck. I haven't changed the settings yet. I have to figure that out on how to make it go farther because it will go farther. I just wasn't able to um, uh, mess with that yet. Joyful Elf joined us on our Thanksgiving holiday and they were enjoying the deck. <laughs> <laughs> 